Hi, I want to go over day 25 of Thirsty by Jamie Morgan. Day 25 is Thirsty to Persevere. Every Christian has a perseverance threshold. Our threshold of perseverance determines the limit to which we're willing to push through the trials of life. It represents how long we'll continue steadfast in times of difficulty. It is the level we're willing to pursue Almighty God when the hordes of hell attack us at every turn. A low perseverance threshold places perimeters around our Christian walk, including whether personal revival will transpire. Even if we experience revival, a low perseverance threshold affects the length of time it will be sustained. If we don't cultivate perseverance, at some point we won't continue to thirst after God, pray without ceasing, contend for revival, press into God when things get hard, allow the fire of adversity to change us into the image of Christ, endure persecution for following hard after Jesus, radically pursue Christ with everything in us. If we draw a line in the sand and say no more, we place a cap on how revived we could have been. Our passion for God will be stymied, but a high perseverance threshold removes all limits from our pursuit of God. But perseverance isn't just forging ahead, bearing under, or putting up with opposition of every kind. It's about the attitude you have while you endure. In James chapter 1, verse 2 through 4, James says, Dear brothers and sisters, when troubles of any kind come your way, consider it an opportunity for great joy. For you know that when your faith is tested, your endurance has a chance to grow. So let it grow, for when your endurance is fully developed... You will be perfect and complete, needing nothing. When James wrote this epistle, Christians were experiencing intense persecution, the kind of persecution most of us will never understand. He admonished them to persevere, no matter how difficult their circumstances were. Regardless of the pressure, stress, or ordeal, they were to stand their ground with unflinching faith and joy. Faith coupled with persistence and bolstered by joy is everything we need to have victory in adversity. Every unfavorable situation in life presents an opportunity to increase our threshold of perseverance. We grow in perseverance when everything in us screams not to persevere, but we persevere anyway. When circumstances in our life present an opportunity to say, I quit, if you learn to endure, your perseverance threshold will enlarge. Determine today that Jesus is worth any amount of pain. You must endure to be everything for him. No cost is too great in your hot pursuit of Jesus. There is purpose in the pain of perseverance. If you don't quit, you win.